You refuse to talk? Well, maybe you will talk to my master, Tang Shao. Ninjas, take him! What the? Oh no. Master Kai Lee. Hello? David, something happened to Master Kai Lee. Looks like someone broke in. What? Did you call the police? No, I'm about to now. After I get their report, I'll be right over. Okay. You are the famous Long Tai Li. You're a pretty good fighter for an old man, from what I heard. Now, I need the other one of the swords. Have you seen it, old man? The other Kasumi sword. How did you get it? This sword I have? I got it in the museum. Now, tell me, where is the other one? I'll never tell you. Your heart is too evil. You fool! Sorry, Master, but I found this paper in his dojo. It has a name and address on it by the name of David Jones. Is he one of your students? Kenjaro, go. Check it out immediately. Yes, Master Tang Shao. Ninja warriors, come with me. It's just a matter of time, Long Tiny. It won't be long. I shall get what I want. Hey, David. Chad, so what the police say? They're not sure. They couldn't find any fingerprints or anything. Man, what would anybody want with Master Tai Li? Well, I'm on my way over there. I'll pick you up and see if we can find anything or any clues at Master's house. Okay, I have some garbage to throw away outside, so I'll just meet you out there. Cool. What? Where did you guys come from? David Jones. How do you know my name? Who are you? My name is not important. But what is important is the Kasumi Sword. Kasumi Sword? Uh, I've never heard of it. Why don't you guys try the ice cream man down the street? I heard he has a new popsicle that looks like a sword. This is not a game. If you would like to see your master, Long Kai Lee, then you will tell me where the sword is now. So it was you guys. Look, I don't have a Kasumi sword, so why don't you let Master Kylie go? We could do this the easy way or the hard way. It makes no difference to me. All I want is the sword. Well, I'm afraid you're not going to get anything until you set Master free. I see you have chosen the hard way. Ninjas, do your thing. Uh oh. David. Join in. It's not you. I've seen it. David, we've got to make it to the car. Don't let them get away. Okay, go, go. We shall meet again. Ninja, vanish. Chad, those are the guys who kidnapped Master Kai Lee. That one guy was asking about the Kasumi sword. You still have it? Yeah, it's right here. No wonder the police couldn't find any fingerprints. Those ninjas were wearing gloves. What do you think we ought to do? I noticed a familiar tattoo on one of those ninjas. My cousin has that same tattoo on his arm. I remember him telling me about the guy who did it. I believe it was Pete's Tattoos. There's a Pete's Tattoo down Franklin Street. 
Well, let's check it out. That might be our lead to finding Master. Yo, yo, yo! What's up, fellas? What's up? We're looking for a guy named Pete. Pete? Well, I'm Pete, and sometimes I can be a creep, but I'm not weak, and I'm sure not cheap. <laughs> so, what kind of tattoo can I get for you guys today? Well, actually, we're just here to talk about one. You sure? I got a wide selection here. From the ever so cute little Barbie doll to the- That's it. That picture of the dragon tutu right there. Have you given that tattoo to a lot of guys lately? Actually, yeah. It's funny you should mention that tattoo. It's been really popular during the last three weeks. Do you know who was the last person you put it on? Uh, it was some Chinese guy, I think. His name was uh, Quasimodo or something. Would you know where we could find him? Uh... I'm I'm sorry, guys. Unless you two were some sort of detectives, uh, I can't give out that information. Hey, Pete, do you know my cousin Ronnie? Oh yeah, old Ronzo. He comes in here all the time. He's your cousin? Oh, <laughs> small world. Yeah, and see, uh, he just wants to get together with someone who has the same dragon tattoo he has. You know, to kind of compare them. Yeah, so they can show it off to other people. You know, to let them know if that anyone wants a great tattoo, that they should come here. Yeah, it will help to promote your business even more. Yeah, yeah! That would work, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah! Well, uh, how come Ronnie couldn't tell me that himself? Um, right now he's at work. Uh, he wanted us to come down and ask you. Oh, well, man's gotta work, I guess. Anyway, uh, it's down the street. It's, a, it's an old abandoned warehouse. Yeah, it's right by that old McDonald's between Greenwood and 3rd. I seen one of those weird Chinese guys I put the tattoo on walk in there one day. You mean you done others? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They've been getting that tattoo, that dragon tattoo, for oh, so quite a bit. Oh, hey, you guys are going downtown to see the fireworks tonight? It's the 4th of July, you know. Always a big thing. I heard the fireworks are going to be all that. You guys take care, all right? Thanks for the information, though, Pete. Yeah. So I guess this is the place. Yeah. See anybody? Not yet, but wait. Yeah, I do. One of those ninjas. Come on, let's see if we can follow him inside so we can grab the sword. Master Team Chow, we have intruders. I believe they are the two that escaped earlier. Huh. Fools. Take care of them and get that sword. Uh-oh. Looks like we got company. Your master is being held inside. Hand over the other Kasumi sword and you will live. Chad, you go ahead. I'll hold these guys off. But what about you? Don't worry. I'll cover for you and keep these guys busy. Out of my way, you cheap reputation ninjas. <laughs> Hold it right there. You guys are nothing but a bunch of sissies and bunch of clothes. You fight is showing you well for a pet. Yeah, you too. I don't think monkeys know how to fight them. Alright, I've had enough of you. It's time to end this. You took the words right out of my mouth. Okay, it's about time to try the Lin City attack. Yeah! No! I did it. Hmm. <laughs> that is far enough.
and over the other Kasumi sword now.